made it to Kobe! Kansai and Jenu? You two certainly seem enthusiastic. Of course we are! We're in K-O-B-E! The Chinese characters for Kobe mean God's door. Yeah, I know that. When you hear Kobe, what is the first thing you think of? Kobe beef? Utopia? Mount Roko? Or Arima Hot Springs? No! Wrong! Kobe, Kobe is all about the Hoshikishuka Theater Company! Uh, Kansai said Hanshin Tigers. And Jenu said Hosekisuka Theater Company? Yeah. That's right. The Hanshin Tigers is my most beloved baseball team. They're from right here in Kobe. Same goes for Hoseki Zuka. Nope. The Tigers' home city is Nishinomiya. And Hoseki Zuka is literally in Hoseki Zuka City. Okay then, let's go! What? Right now? Don't be crazy! He spent the whole day biking and walking to get this far. The bike got a flat tire on the way here. Let's camp here today. I'm down for that! Yeah, good idea. But we're out of food! We need to get canned food and stuff like that! There was a supermarket on our way here. Maybe if we go there... Yeah, let's head there and have a look. Nyoro, what's the matter? Everyone left already. Well, um... What is that? This scrap of paper I've been holding all this time. It's like my good luck charm. It says... X... X... Y? I remembered when I heard what Jinu said earlier. She said that Kobe means God's door, right? Uh, I don't get it. What do you mean? My father went missing when I was eight. And right before that, he called me into his lab. Listen to me. Don't ever tell anyone about this paper I'm giving you. On this paper are numbers. Numbers you need to open God's door. If something happens to me, use those numbers and open God's door. Don't worry. You can do it as long as you don't give up. And this is what he gave me. I had no idea what he meant at the time. What is this God's door? What does XXY mean? Dad just gave me this scrap of paper and disappeared. You don't know where he is? No. The only hint I have is this paper and these three letters written on it. but I won't ever give up. 
I swear I'll solve this mystery. Because if you never give up, you can overcome any obstacles. Remember when we were escaping on the bike yesterday? We sang that song, right? The Go-Getters Club Anthem. <sighs> Even if the world ends, the Go-Getters Club will stay together, right? I remember us singing it a lot back in the day, when she was still with us. Yesterday, we were all brainwashed, and you saved us. Yeah, and? I mean, we were this close to being sacrificed. No matter how many times I thank you, it's not enough. No. Oh, thank everyone else. I didn't do a damn thing. Besides, my plan was to just leave you guys behind. It's obvious, isn't it? We head back to Tokyo. So you were just going to abandon the others? What do you expect? Sure, I was just going to give up on you all. That's the kind of guy I am. was you before you knew about the sacrifice, right? Oh. You were doing it for all of us, weren't you, Aniki? I mean, I don't think I can walk anymore. Just let the complainers get some rest and get those who can still walk to Tokyo as quick as possible. Then you just come back and pick us up later. That's what you were really thinking, wasn't it? Oh. And Jenu told me, as soon as you found out about the sacrifice, you started hunting for mushrooms like crazy. So, just, thanks for everything. Huh. Like I said before, Kobe is all about the Hanshin Tigers. To be exact, it's in Nishinomiya. That's where the Tigers' home field is located. For baseball fans like me, that's a holy place. So as soon as you get some rest, that's where we're headed. What? Come this far and not go to the field? Are you nuts? It'd be like ordering a takoyaki and leaving the octopus out. The tigers are in a slump right now. In fact, it's the worst slump in their history. But the Tigers and that baseball field are where my soul lives! Huh? It'd be better to not go? <sighs> Good point. No one wants to see a ruined holy place. Oh well. Let's forget about it this time. We 
You were lucky the Amygdaclear was so close. Amygdaclear is a very rare mushroom. Not only does it help the brain recover lost function, but it's also known for being delicious. Supposedly, they were so overpicked that there are barely any left. So not only is it a medicine, but it's a much sought after ingredient. I know everyone loved the dish I made the other day, but it's all thanks to the ingredients. It couldn't help but be delicious. Next time, I won't rely on the ingredient. I'll use my cooking skills. my mouth. It's like my whole body wants to puke to get it out of there. Whoa. Just remembering it is making me... I thought I could eat anything, except for tonkotsu ramen, that is. But now that's number one on my list of the world's grossest foods. I think the next time I eat it, I'll die. through my tired body. I'm rejuvenated. So it's the perfect drink for us right now. The crisp sweetness combined with the mild tingle of the soda. I could drink it forever. When we were brainwashed, we heard the others talking. They said the sacrifice would be on Shoto Island in the Seto Inland Sea. Shoto Island. That place is used lots in movies and TV shows. That's right! The Electro Rangers shot a show on Shoto Island once. Oh man, I wanted to make a pilgrimage there. Now I'm kind of bummed. Another earthquake. <sighs> yeah. I'm okay. I'm okay. It just stirred up some bad memories. I think it was 1990. That's when all these earthquakes started happening. After that, every country in the world started having giant earthquakes. Of course, lots of people died. One of them was my sister. She died in an earthquake in Kyoto. If only she hadn't gone to Kyoto. If I'd stopped her from going, she'd still be alive. Like I told you earlier, Kobe is all about the Hosekizuka Theater Group. They're technically from Hosekizuka, but Kobe is where their main theater is. And it's also where the Hosekizuka Musical School is. It's for training future members. So it's truly a holy place for Hosekizuka fans. So after we rest tonight, let's all go together. Well, that's what I want to say, but I guess we shouldn't. With the way things are, I don't want to see the place in ruins. And besides, I don't have the right. 
I swore I wouldn't go there until I passed music school. For my dear sister. X, X, Y. Huh. The code that Neil Rose's dad gave to her. On this paper are numbers. Numbers you need to open God's door. If something happens to me, use those numbers and open God's door. Numbers. Numbers. Huh. In Roman numerals, X is 10. But I don't know what Y can mean. Hmm. I guess this paper isn't enough to figure it out. We need to find some kind of hint. Those cold creeps! Mankind is extinct! What a lie! Mankind can't just go extinct like that! makes me furious, but it would explain this situation. No, I don't believe it! I know my mom and dad are still alive! I just know it! We've made it to Kobe, so Osaka is just right around the corner. I told you, didn't I? There's something important I need to do in Osaka. There's something I need to know. And I think someone in Osaka can tell me. By the way, don't even ask what it is. It's a girl's secret. Huh? But are there even any people in Osaka? Uh, sure, of course there are people. taught me the importance of never giving up was my dad. No matter how bad things got, I never gave up. My dad never gave up either. No matter what the obstacles were, he always overcame them. That's why he made it so far in his research. And it's always been the kind of research to help mankind. When I grow up, I want to be just like my dad. I want to be a great researcher just like him. So, I was thinking about the powers I've got now. That F-bomb. I just thought of the idea and was able to make it so fast. It didn't even feel like it was me doing it. The speed of my thinking, the sensitivity of my touch, it felt almost superhuman. So it must be like the superpower that Rachel has. Was it something we are born with? Or a power implanted in us? Even though it's creepy, I'm kind of happy about it too. I felt like I got a little closer to my dad, the genius. We should stay at that cold place. I really screwed up. That's minus three points on the leader score. Just three? Just be honest and admit you don't have what it takes to be a leader. Oh, hell no! I'll never say that! I won't hand this leader badge to anyone! Come to think of it, I've always wondered... Why do you want to be the leader so bad anyway, Kansai? Well... well... It's 
because you want to be like Neon, right? Neon? He was Kansai's baseball coach. He's from Osaka and Kansai wants to be just like him. That's why Kansai uses the Kansai dialect, even though he's from Tokyo. Yo, Chuko, you don't have to blab about all that. Ah, uh, come on, what's the problem? Chuko, how do you know so much? I used to watch them practice and go to their games a lot. Why? Well, well... Oh, I know. Chuko has a massive crush on Kansai. So she was like his groupie going to the baseball field every day. Right, Chuko? <laughs> Anyways, Neon was a super cool guy. He never said anything when we screwed up. And he was always happy for us when we succeeded. He's what a real man is supposed to be. But one day, Neon had to move to Kyoto for his work. Damn it! Damn it! And today was our last game! Last? Neon, you're moving to Kyoto, right? So today is the last game you can watch! But we made all those dumb errors! <laughs> hey, you're gonna be captain when you become a sixth grader, right? So you better not say things like that. Huh? Listen to me. To be a true leader, you gotta think about how your teammates feel. No matter what happens, you protect your own. That's what a true leader does. A true leader? <laughs> <sighs> Here, take this. But this is your favorite. Yeah, my symbol of leadership, my leader badge. Come visit me in Kyoto when you become a man worthy of that badge. But I, I... Don't worry. You're going to be a great leader someday. I believe in you. <laughs> Neon! Neon! So remember, you got to become a man worthy of that thing, or Neon here is going to have to whoop your butt. So, that's why, huh? That makes me see you a little different, Kansai. Uh. Huh? What's the matter, Jenu? You look so serious. No, it's nothing. What's the matter? Did my story make you all weepy? It was a totally stupid story anyway. Right, Mochan? <laughs> I'm full now, so I'm sleepy. What? Sleep already? Hey, Nyoro, why don't we stay up late and do some girl talk? Hmm. I'm kind of tired, so maybe we should just rest tonight. Yeah, if we stay up too late, Nighthawk will kidnap us. Jeez, Tatsun, you're still talking about the Electro Rangers? You're like totally obsessed. Well, let's call it a night. Don't forget to brush your teeth before you sleep. <laughs> Look who's talking. The messiest one of us. The 
messiest one is. <sighs> oh. Jeez, I know I'm just wasting my time. It's not even worth it. No one can hear me. At first, I was just happy still being with everyone. Even if you can't hear me, I thought it would be enough to be with you all. But it still hurts. It's just not enough for me. It feels like you've all turned your backs on me. saying Vanilla's name? <sighs> oh. Don't you sit there, say something! Is this some kind of joke? If it is, it's in real bad taste. Some things you just can't joke about. There's no way Vanilla could be here. Yeah, you're right. I mean, Vanilla... Vanilla died two years ago. She died. Okay then, so about last night, 
Rachel. Hi, Rachel, is it true you three saw Vanilla? Yeah. I swear. <sighs> Cut the crap. Hang on, Aniki. Let's hear them out. <laughs> Do whatever you want. How long have you been able to see her? Well, it was last year. I mean, two years ago. From September 1994. So it was about a month after Vanilla died. Ever since then, both Pi and me have been able to see her. But Rachel transferred about half a year later, right? So, for Rachel, it's from then. So you saw Miss Vanilla's ghost then? I think so. But she had legs. So you mean this ghost has been with us since Kagoshima? It wasn't from Kagoshima. She was on the bus with us for the field trip, too. Yeah. And she was in school with us, too. Why the hell did you keep quiet all this time? Well, because we didn't think you'd believe us. I mean, even now, you don't believe us, do you? Honestly, I'm kind of on the fence. If what Pochi says is true, why was it just you three who saw her? You guys all know my family runs a Shinto shrine, right? We've had the sixth sense for generation after generation. But what about Pochi and Rachel? Well, this is just my guess, but maybe it has to do with that X-shaped thing. X? Well, there was this weird-looking shape floating in the sky. You can see it here, and in other towns, too. But not all you guys can see it, right? The only ones who can see it are Rachel, Pi, Vanilla, and me. So are you saying that the X thing is a ghost too? No, it's definitely not a ghost. So what are you saying? Well, the people who can see the X can also see Vanilla. That can't just be a coincidence, right? Enough already! So you say you can see vanilla and some stupid thing in the sky, huh? Well, I say you're all full of crap. There's no such thing as ghosts. If there were, then why... Then why hasn't she... Chew 
Yuko being bitten by a rat? That's like cannibalism! What is your problem? I'm just kidding. Jeez, what's your problem? A sweet little girl hurt her finger! Why don't you say something nice for a change? Ah, uh, okay, sure. Sweet little girl, huh? I guess the rat thought your finger was sweet, all right! <laughs> You're the worst. That's why you will never be a leader. What did you say? No matter what you do, you'll never be anywhere near as good as Neon. Why, you nasty little stumpy, frumpy whisk jet! Oh, yeah? You stuck-up, pinheaded, brainless fart knocker! Oh, come on, you guys! Hmm! Gah! Anyway, Miss Chuko, why did you stick your hand in there? Oh, well, that's because... You wanted this, right? Aniki. You were trying to get this flyer, right? Y yes What is that thing? If you see this flyer, please come to Kyoto. If you come to Kyoto... Oh. <gasps> hey! This is... So mankind didn't go extinct! There are survivors besides that religious cult in Ehime! We don't know when this was written. Right. It could have been written before people disappeared. That may be true. But what if you're wrong? If we go to Kyoto, there's a chance we can meet normal people. Yeah, but we can't just base our decision on that. If you come to Kyoto, I wonder what they wanted to say. We have to go to Kyoto to find out. Hold on a second. No one's going to Kyoto. The next place we're headed is Osaka. But if we go to Kyoto, we may find someone! Yeah, but what if they're whack jobs like the cult members in Ehime? Yeah! This could be a trap! They're spreading flyers and trying to lure us in! You think so too, Mochan? Yeah! We definitely should head to Osaka! Takoyaki, kushikatsu, okonomiyaki, udon, pork buns, blowfish, kitsuba! I'm gonna eat until I drop! I'm with Kansai and Mochan. If we go to Osaka, we may find vanilla! What? Why? Vanilla was always saying... I want to go to Osaka! I don't know what it is, but she said she had important business in Osaka. Then it's set. Osaka it is! Yeah! Now it's even more of a priority! Then I'll choose Osaka. I don't think Pai or Pochi would lie about this. So you're saying ghosts exist? That's right. Sorry, but I just can't believe it. As a daughter of a scientist, I can't accept the existence of ghosts. So you're saying we should go to Kyoto and Yoro? I feel like that has a bigger chance of working out for us. Then you're with me. I also agree with Kyoto. I've always wanted to visit Kyoto's Toei Studio Park. 
That's the sacred place where the Electro Rangers movie was filmed. I vote for Kyoto. Sure, we don't know who dropped this flyer, but if there's a chance we can find someone. But if we go to Osaka, we may find Vanilla. Like I said before, I don't believe you. I'm with Nyoro. I don't believe in ghosts. The whole vote depends on Rachel's decision, huh? No matter what Pochi decides on, Rachel's two points will tip it over. Hey, Rachel, what are you gonna pick? Yeah, who are you going to side with? So that's what you're going for, after all? <laughs> then do whatever you want. The four of us are going to Kyoto. Sorry, but we split up here. What? Wait a minute! I didn't mean for that to happen! The road is so long, the nights are so cold But our friends have been there from the start even if the world comes to an end, go, 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 getters will never fall apart. I guess Vanilla really liked this song. You guys may not have heard her, but she sings it all the time. I think that's what Vanilla wanted. So? <sighs> Fine. You guys are right. I almost forgot. I was really sorry about the way we split between Oita and Fukuoka. Yeah, I felt the same when we were at that religious facility. It would be stupid to make the same mistake again. <sighs> Fine. I'll go. I'll go. Okay! It's set then! <laughs> 